This is what the Alfredo was looking like. So today might be my starter log anniversary. Right here. So it's 8.30. We got to be there like by 8.50. I'm trying to decide um, if I want to get some quick breakfast or if I want to just wait till lunch. I don't know yet, but yeah. I just want to come open up the vlog for y'all, tell y'all what's up, good morning type of shit, and I'm going to talk to y'all later. Y'all, these folks love um, fettuccine noodles. I don't see them nowhere over here. This the brand that I usually get. I don't see them right here. I don't see them in the great value. Nope, so I guess I'm gonna have to... Sanguini, I don't even know what that is. Angel hair, there is no fettuccine noodles anywhere. Alright y'all, so I found some fettuccine noodles. I'm about to head home and um, prep it and try to get it already cooking before it's time to go get my son. This weed coming off y'all. It's not even hot today, but this just making it making me way more hotter. So it's my it's supposed to be my work wig, but I can't do it. I just want to take it off. I think it's because I know like it's not glued on that I just want to like take it off even more. Where's she going? Girl, you already out there like. Anyway, so yeah. I'm about to go. I'm about to go home, snatch this wig off. And then I'm gonna start cooking. I don't know if I wanna do a separate video cooking for y'all or if I wanna make a um, for real. I don't know. But I need to start doing more stuff like that, like content within content while filming a video. Yeah. I just don't. Like when I started this morning, when I, I think I talked to y'all this morning, and the bob was just flowing, right? And then it just starts to get like this. And a hump from my um, hat. That's just too much for me. I'm gonna talk to y'all later. All right, y'all. So these are seasonings I use: total seasoning, Creole, slap your mama, black pepper, paprika, and salt. A little bit of salt. I'm really scared of salt because I don't want my food to be too salty. This is what the shrimp looking like. The salmon is in the oven already cooking. And the noodles going. I got the sausage already cut up and some spinach. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cook the sausage, put the spinach in there, then I'm gonna add the heavy whipping cream. So I'm gonna add the heavy whipping cream while all that stuff. Or do I wanna do it like that? I think I'm gonna just do the sausage and then um take the sausage out. Heavy whipping cream with the spinach and then add the sausage back. I'm not doing a video. I told y'all I thought I wanted to, but I don't want to. I really don't feel like doing a video, a cooking video. I can't wait till my lease up so I can get a bigger kitchen and have like room to actually move around. Cause everything is like boom, 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 boom. So yeah, um, I'm gonna show y'all. You know, y'all know I'm gonna show y'all when I get finished. All I do is eat and show y'all food. But all jokes aside, I've been planning on, not really planning yet, 
but I've been thinking about doing um, the 75 hard or 75 soft challenge. I've been thinking about it. It's been real heavy. I've been searching it on TikTok. Now, every time I go on TikTok, all I see is 75 hard, 75 soft. So, I'm, I'm planning on doing it. But y'all know when I do decide to do it, I'm going to go ahead and cook the sausage out. This is what the Alfredo is looking like. I got some beef sausage, some shrimp, some spinach in there. I'm late putting the toast in there, but this is the salmon. So yeah, I'm gonna show y'all it when I plate it up. So it's supposed to be an um, Alfredo, shrimp Alfredo topped with salmon, but yeah, it's just shrimp Alfredo with spinach and sausage and salmon on the side, okay? This is what it's looking like, y'all. Um, I tasted a little bit already, so I know it's good. It's raining, and we're going to the car wash while it's raining. Make it make sense, girl. Make it make sense. and they rules and shit like that um but yeah like i woke up feeling weird and then i came to work and it was just like down here from the the whole day just been annoying <sighs> y'all can feel what I'm saying right now from my energy like this whole day I'm gonna try again tomorrow so I don't really feel like cooking we got some leftover pasta I might eat some leftover pasta or um depending on what my son wants either the leftover pasta or order some pizza it's gonna be a smooth little night tonight I don't feel like doing nothing I'm gonna help him with his homework if he got some I'm gonna iron his clothes tonight because I ironed this morning. I had to wake up a little um, earlier. I ironed his clothes and fix him some lunch. He wanted to take his lunch today. So I'm gonna iron his clothes tonight after he goes to sleep. He's gonna go to sleep. 
Well, he, I don't know. He lay down at 9. He usually be asleep before 10, for real, before 9.30. But he lay down at 9, so when he lay down, I'm going to just iron his clothes, put him on the sofa. And if he want another lunch, I'll fix him lunch. And then that's it. I'm going to chill. I'm going to try to be in the bed and sleep by 11.30. Because I just need to relax. But... On the right side, I'm doing hair all weekend, so I'm be making a little bit of money. I made him a hair appointment for this weekend. He's gonna get some two strand twist. Um, when he was in the holiday camp, they went swimming and everything, so his hair came undone from the style that it was in, and then like he went back to the pool two more times. So now it's like frizzy a little bit, and it's starting to stand up. He told me he don't like when his hair stand up. So I went ahead and made his hair appointment today. His usual loctician. Um, she was available, so that's good. So yeah, that's really, I mean, good thing is we woke up. He was excited to go back to school. I'm doing hair this weekend. That's the only good thing. Everything else about this day, been bad. Not even really bad, but it's like, it's just been annoying. Really annoying. So... Excuse me. I'm going to talk to y'all when I pick him up. Y'all, I just finished editing this video. I'm trying to save it, and the program just stopped working. It asked if I want to close it or wait for it to respond. I said wait because if I close it, I feel like none of the stuff that I um, edited on there is going to be on there. So, let me see how it goes. to get checked and um like just see what we got what we don't got and then write it down so that we can get the stuff that we don't have but anyway so i'm gonna go back to work but um i just came to tell y'all that i just did something very what's the word impulsive so i just made an appointment i looked at this girl um and y'all know i be having bad luck with these hairstylists and kitchen stylists, as they used to call them. I be having bad luck. They just don't do it how I want it. But I looked at this girl at Instagram, and her starter locks look pretty good. So I'm going to try it again. I have an appointment today at 5. Um, her website said 5 to 7, so it takes two hours to do starter locks. And it comes with a shampoo, a wash and, shamp a wash and condition. It's been a long time since I've been to a salon or whatever, but it comes with shampoo service. So she's going to um, wash my hair for me and everything. And I'm asking her about a trim. Trim wasn't on her site, but she said that she knows how to do a trim. So I'm going to ask her to trim the ends or whatever. I'm going to show her the picture that I showed y'all last time. That is how small I want them. It's not like micro loss. It's just smaller squares that's how i want them and i want them to be two strand twist starter lock method so anyway i booked the appointment i have an appointment today friday at six o'clock today is january 6th so today might be my starter lock my lock anniversary my lock date i don't know but i made the appointment so i'm leaving work um at 5 4 45 if we're still here we should be gone by the end but if we still here, I'm going to leave work at 445. She's located in Hinesville, so that's good. I ain't got to go too far. And, yeah, y'all, I'm going to get some locks. And I really didn't know if I wanted to get them or not because I was supposed to be going to the field. But now I'm not going to the field anymore for the 30 days. Um, 
it's a lot. That's the reason why I'm not going, but I'm not going. And I was going to do some box braids and stuff like that. But y'all, I done tried all the styles in the world. I really been wanting locks. I like like the um, lock look, not the starter lock look, cause they be all small. But I like the people who be having locks. They just look so gorgeous. The locks look beautiful and everything. So I'm gonna do it. And also, I'm thinking about starting my locks now because these wigs. I don't know if I take them off wrong or what. But like when I had the wigs and the faux locks, I have a habit. Of like doing my hair like this to get the um, edge control off, and I know that's probably the reason why it's thinning now. But I want them to give my edges a break so they can like grow back and stuff. But yeah, I'm getting locks today, y'all. I hope I like them. I hope I like them. So I'm gonna start the um, I'm gonna start my lock journey, and then probably around February I'm gonna do the. 75 hard 75 soft challenge that i was telling y'all about too and it's gonna be a new me i'm trying to lose a little weight lose fat i don't want to lose my stomach but you know it's like no when you lose weight it's nothing you can't pinpoint where you lose weight at you're just gonna lose it where you lose it at. but i really want to lose my stomach so eat more healthy um try to lose some weight i'm starting my locks 2023 y'all we here, we here. I really hope I like them. The locks, like I said on her Instagram page, they look really good. So hopefully it's all right. And the last lady charged me, I think it was eighty dollars. This lady's lock service, starter lock service, is a hundred. So I mean, not too expensive at all. So yeah, fingers crossed. <laughs> <laughs> Alright y'all, so I just left work. I am headed to get my hair done. Wish me luck, y'all. Wish me luck. I'm a little nervous. I sent her the picture of what I wanted. I told her I want a small. I told her I want two strand twists. The two strand twist lock method. And this time I'm not gonna get no style because the style threw me off last time. So yeah, wish me luck, y'all. I'm a little nervous. It's like every time I try to get my hair done, they don't do it how I want it. So that's why I usually do my own hair. And I can do my own locks. It's just, I didn't feel like it. And I, I would need a mirror and stuff trying to look at the back. So I just didn't feel like it, but I'm not finna get in to eat. I'm really rushing right now. Cause I left work at uh, 4.45, it's 4.55 right now. And my appointment is at five. So yeah, shampoo edition, trim. Twist me up. Let me talk to y'all later. She don't know why it took her, took her so long to do it this time, but it was real cool. I got a, I told y'all a wash and she trimmed me a little bit, and I didn't get to see um, the style before I left. But I'm gonna show y'all when I get home. I'm gonna look at it. I'm gonna take a picture of the back and everything like that, and see what it's looking like. I just left. I'm tired, y'all. I gotta get some to eat. I'm gonna get some um, Wendy's probably. I'm gonna get me a biggie bag. So yeah, I'm gonna talk to y'all when I get home. All right, y'all, I'm not even gonna lie. I just seen the back and I'm not fucking with it. I'm not fucking with it. Maybe I'm being picky. I don't know. Um, she did a good job in itself with the two strand twist, but I'm gonna insert a picture on why I don't like it. Because, like, so when you're doing hair, right? Well, when I do hair, I do it in a brick lay effect. So one row, then the other row is not directly on top. The other row falls in between the squares of the previous row. Like, that's how I wanted my hair to be. But these locks are like one row, one row, one row, like on top of each other. I don't want it to fall like that. I want it to fall in between each other. 
So for that reason, that's why I don't like it. And I'm probably gonna keep it in for like a week or so, but just to like get a little bit of money's worth and not to take it out tonight. But I'm not keeping, I'm not gonna let them lock it up like that. I'm probably gonna keep it in for just a week and then take it down because it's not what I wanted. It's not what I wanted at all. And I told myself, if this time go bad, I'ma just suck it up and do it myself. That's what I'm gonna have to do. Do it myself. Cause this, this ain't it. This is not it. Good morning, y'all. Today is Saturday. I just dropped my son off at his hair appointment. He's getting a um, retwist and two strand twist style. So I'm headed back home. I'm about to take a shower. I'm about to fold up some clothes and then prep the hair for me because I'm doing hair at one o'clock. And this stuff is still in here. I might eat um, one of his little pancake sausage corn dog things. Pancake sausage on a stick. Yeah, I might eat one of those. But the back up then go around in the circle. Mm -hmm. Can you see the back? Yeah, that's cute. So as you can see, I did my hair today. Um, it took me six and a half hours. I did it today, this morning. Then we went to eat. Y'all saw we went to eat at Olive Garden. And then we was going to go to like the skating rink. So it's going to be like a little date night, kid-friendly date night out to eat and skating. But when we got there, they had a sign up that said um, adult night. 21 and older, gotta have ID, blah, blah, blah. So they told us we can't come in. So I'm just taking my son out skating sometime this week or this weekend coming up because he really wants to go skating. So yeah, that's all I did today. All I did was my hair. And that's it. I ain't really talked to y'all in a long time because I wasn't fucking with my hair like I didn't like those starter locks so ain't that cute so I didn't vlog but now that I did my hair I just did like Senegalese twists and I put braids at the root so that they'll stay a little longer I keep these for a little under a month because I want to change my hair for Valentine's Day I don't know to what I want to change it but yeah so kind of small, um, kind of small, and it took six and a half hours on me from start to finish, and I was taking a little break. But yeah, I'll talk to y'all in a few when I get done making this hookah. What's up, y'all? So we went to um. Truck was smoothie. I wanted to get some of the drink real quick. And I was gonna bring him to the park, but I yeah. I woke him up. I was like, "Do you want to go to the park?" Really? He said, "Yeah." While we in Truck with Smoothie line, he went back to sleep. Elijah. You wanna go to the park or you wanna lay down? Park. You seem tired. Yeah. 
Have y'all ever tried this brand? We're gonna try it out. Um, I got this for a new and digestive health. Yeah, I just got some women's, men's, and kids. So yeah. So I made some general toast of chicken, frozen, and some chicken fried rice. It's good. I'm going to put on the refrigerator the rest of the meal we're eating. Yeah. Alright y'all, so he's going to try his vitamin and he's going to let us know how it tastes. So it says kids, multi, and probiotic. And it's great flavor. Yep. And I hope it tastes good too. And it says um, so kids, ages two or three, take one, four plus, take two. So we're gonna take two. Okay. Your phone ringing. I'm gonna call you. I don't know what it's called. It's probably YouTube. That's it. Hmm. So I use this wax candle, but I don't really smell it anymore. I need to clean it off too. I don't really smell it that much, so I just um, burn it just because. But I got this candle from Walmart. It's one of the candles I got. It's salted coconut mahogany. Why is it not focusing? Okay. So yeah, I'm about to just light this right quick.
Damn. Good morning, y'all. So today is January 17th. It's Tuesday, and I'm leaving PT right now. I just wanted to come and end the vlog for y'all. I didn't want to just leave it like, you know, nothing. So I just wanted to come in the vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And stay tuned for more videos. I'll see y'all in the next one. Bye, y'all.